I'm Andrea Martinez, I'm Deputy Managing Director of Synlock and Project Coordinator of Estia. Estia is a project financed by the European Commission, which has come to an end today and has brought us over the last few years uh, across different European countries, the Netherlands, France and Italy, to deploy demand response uh, services and uh, develop a user engagement process to uh, engage communities in the local market flexibility. We have seen uh, a strong interest on the, in the communities to engage in these uh, new uh, ways of living uh, proactively the energy markets. Uh, but further work will have to be done to make it viable, sustainable, and for sure, as I addressed before, scalability will be an issue. Another element which uh, has uh, emerged from this project uh, is uh, that we, need to we still need to remove a number of barriers. We need to remove uh, legal framework barriers. Uh, the different European countries have adopted in different way the renewable energy directives and there is still some work to be done to make sure that the value which can be created through user engagement and technology can actually be activated. We probably still need also to ensure that for some years uh, sufficient funding is provided to uh, promote, to, to, to incentivate the aggregation of uh, users in energy communities and potentially also support them individually or better still as a community to make investments in renewables, storage assets, i.e. as energy assets which make them, can make them uh, a proper actor in the energy market. My name is uh, Christian Kunze. I'm working for Smart Innovation Norway as a senior energy researcher. And I'm also the coordinator of the EU-funded Horizon 2020 project Sender. And today we are in Luxembourg and have the final event for three sister projects for Hestia, Accept and Sender. And in this final event, we discussed the project outcomes in terms of energy communities, in terms of core innovations of our projects and also in future steps that we will conduct in the projects. And in my opinion, this event here in Luxembourg was very fruitful because uh, after four years of intense cooperation with the sister projects, we were all able to provide sufficient results which will steer in a way the future of energy communities in Europe and therefore we were very proud to be part of this process and we hope to find additional opportunities to use the existing infrastructure of our projects.